the wind here at Lake Havasu today has been crazy. <laughs> been 40 to 50 miles per hour wind gust and believe me I have felt it in the truck camper but so I have been inside all day here we go whoa I mean you can feel it rocking side to side anyway I've been inside all day um, been cleaning just doing things that I needed to do but now it's time to cook. So what am I gonna cook today? It's a frugal tip. This is cheap. I know they're not, you know, great for you, but these are under a dollar at Walmart. And what I do is I'm gonna add some onion, mushrooms. So I have a red bell pepper here, and I might also add some dehydrated chicken. And I will show you that too here in a minute. And this is my dehydrated chicken. And no, I didn't dehydrate it myself, but I bought it in a number 10 can and I put it in a baggie so I don't carry the tin around. So this is very lightweight. I don't have to defrost any chicken when I want it. And I will show you what it looks like after I have refreshed the chicken. And then I'm going to add that to the noodles. Since I am boondocking, I'm just going to heat up some water in my tea kettle here. And I am going to rehydrate my chicken, which is here. I'm just going to put it in a, a cup. And I'm also going to add the hot water to the noodles to get those cooking. So I'm not going to use a microwave. So I have my bell pepper cut up, my onion, and my mushrooms, and I will be throwing those in a skillet here in a bit when my tea kettle gets warm, and I will reconstitute my chicken. I have the onion and the bell pepper sauteing in a little bit of butter, and now I've added the mushrooms with those get picked in really good. The wind is blowing bad. I added the dehydrated chicken, or it's rehydrated now. And now I'm going to add the noodles. Ooh, fogging up the camera. I'm gonna add the packet. This is a spicy chicken. I'm gonna add the packet, but then I'm also going to add sriracha. Okay, this is the finished product. I'm gonna plate it up, and then I'm gonna add a few little cashews, and that will top it off. 